A wedding is a celebration of love and commitment. It's the setting in which Jesus performed his first miracle, and it's the imagery that the Bible uses to describe Christ's triumphant return. A wedding is also, for two people who follow Christ, a worship service. And so friends and family have gathered here today from near and far to celebrate both of you and the joining of you in the covenant of marriage as we worship the God who brought you together. Generally how it goes is that the younger one looks up to the older one to see how they handle situations, what they do and how they get to do it, and then push the boundary of them getting to do it sooner than the rest of us did. Although this is something that may be true to some extent, I think in our situation it may be opposite. Emma Kate embodies all things that I aspire to be and more. She is hardworking, generous, kind. She's always up for an adventure. She is constantly pointing myself, our family, and others around her to Christ just by the way that she lives her everyday life. And what a testament that is to your character. We grew up, and I remember you heading off to college, where you said, and I quote, I'm not going to date or find a girl for at least two years. <laughs> that was cute. Because, <laughs> because on the second day of school, you met this pretty cool gal named E.K. Little to say, a few months later, I got to meet this beautiful girl that was way out of my brother's league. <laughs> and underneath the sweetest voice and the warmest smile, I saw a heart that was in love with my best friend. We've been praying for the perfect woman for my brother. He's a special kid, and we knew it would require even a more special girl. But we got abundantly more than what we could have ever asked for. It has been a true joy to get to see you with Emma Kate and how much you love and admire her. You are sensitive, always up for something, and fighting for the Lord's will in everyone's life that you come in contact with. And I think that was very evident from last night at the rehearsal dinner. Lots of you weren't there, but every single one of Gain's friends said the exact same thing about him. And that is a testament to his character. I'm on your team forever, and we'll stand by y'all through anything. I love you guys. Hey, McKate, I still can't believe that today is finally here. Feels like I've known you my whole life, but I remember every single detail about the day I met you just three years ago. I couldn't tell you an exact date of when I started, but I've been praying for, my, for you, my wife, for years now. Games McCord. <laughs> <laughs> As we stand here today with all of our closest friends and family, I can't help but be reminded. <laughs> of how faithful and kind God has been to both of us. You are far more than I could have ever imagined for myself and perfect in my eyes. From the moment I met you, I knew there was something different, how genuinely kind you are, how you seek to see the good in everyone you meet, how you live without fear, trusting that the Lord is always in control, how everyone you meet is automatically your best friend, <laughs> how I never have to doubt the love that you have for me, and most importantly, how you always strive to choose what is God honoring over all else. I truly believe that when God created this earth, He intended us to be together. I feel as if I'm a better person today because I met you. I promise to do the same for you each day. I promise to lead you spiritually and pray for you every single day. I will laugh with you, I will cry with you, and celebrate with you. I will protect you, help you, and lead you in the right direction every single day. I promise to always love you every day in my life. I promise to strive to love and serve you above all else in hopes of being a glimpse of the love that Jesus has for you. Mm -hmm. I promise that even when days and seasons are hard, I will stand by your side to make it to the sweeter days ahead. I promise to love and cherish you forever. Getting to marry you has always been a dream of mine. Your imperfections, if I can ever find any, will only serve to love you more. You are perfect in my eyes, not like me. I forever love you until God calls me home. I am so excited to do life with you every single day, EK. I love you. I promise to be your biggest fan, 
to support your great adventures and dreams and to trust you as the leader of our family. And I promise that even as you change from who you are today, I will always choose you and love you. I am yours for all of my days. <laughs> Pray without ceasing for each other, pray together and often, creating a more intimate spiritual bond. Haley and I and everyone in this room will be praying for you and we want the best for you too. You're both so loved and we cannot wait to see where the Lord takes you. I love you both and, cher and cherish y'all forever. Cheers to forever y'all. <laughs>